The Port Authority of Guam's more than $200 million plan to upgrade the island's port will have a minimal impact on the cost of living and doing business here on Guam. That was the word from Port Authority Chairman Monty Mesa today in a speech before the Guam Contractors Association. Mesa said the port's projected tariff hikes in light of the plan would increase the cost of retail goods on Guam by about 1 percent over the next 20 years. Port Authority General Manager Glenn Leon Guerrero says these findings come after the legislature in December approved the port's master plan on the condition that it provide an economic impact analysis for it and a financial plan. He adds the bulk of the financing for the long overdue port modernization will come from federal sources. So we, we're, we're behind the eight ball, we need to get it done. It's going to cost us about $206 million, and we're looking at doing that within six years. Um, for the first phase, we're looking at uh, $100 million, $50 million in a USDA loan, and, uh, and $50 million in a, in a IRA grant. So we'll, we'll know about the results of our application by the end of, uh, end of this year, but we're, we're, we're anticipating a, a favorable outcome. And he says the port will have a lot of work to juggle in the coming years with its modernization effort and the pending military buildup on the island. The military buildup is coming on and it'll be um, within the next year or so. Um, so this is a four-year project, obviously we'll be um, uh, having to do a double task during construction as well as maintaining the operations. Um, so it'll be, it'll be uh, testy for, the, for a couple of years, but after that we should be, we should be good to go. Leon Guerrero adds the port is also cooperating with a government probe into the controversy surrounding the port's award of a $350,000 outreach contract to the firm M2D2. The AG has come to our office and we're just look, waiting for the outcome of that. Uh, as I said before, I'm, I, I'd be quite surprised if, they, if, if, if um, they're, they're inappropriate, uh, um, if there's improprieties that are, that are done. I don't, I don't expect that. I know that uh, in, in the interest of us getting the port to, to where it is today, um, we needed a, a whole groundswell of, um, of um, support. Meanwhile, in addition to the millions in federal aid the port aims to get for its modernization, Mesa today said the port could borrow up to $54 million for the plan. Stefan Sebastian, PNC News.